Hi everyone and welcome to the Grumpy Home Chef. On today's menu we're cooking Nigella Wilson's Madeira Cake. First thing you need for this is butter and Madeira Cake has a lot of butter so be prepared. Also has caster sugar, lemon zest, plain flour, lemon juice, Self raising flour and finally some eggs. Now, Madeira cake is a fairly simple kind of cake to make, only has a few ingredients, but turns out delicious. First thing that you have to do is cream your butter and sugar together. Now, cream this at a fairly about halfway speed and you cream it until the colour changes to a light yellow and, f and it becomes fluffy. After that, you add the lemon zest mix it in for a little bit and then it's incorporating the eggs now for each egg that you add you add a tablespoon of flour so each egg gets incorporated separately now firstly I apologize for the camera work I was trying with some different angles and some of them worked and some of them didn't I quite like one of the ones at the end that you'll see um, but these ones mixing didn't really work. After you've incorporated the eggs you then incorporate the rest of the flour so that's the remainder of any plain flour that you have and the self-raising flour. Gently mix that in not too hard so probably on a speed of two if your mixer goes to ten. After you've done that you then add the last ingredient which is the lemon juice and that doesn't take long to incorporate that's a couple of couple of minutes at the most. Once that's happened you then pour it into your prepared pan and after it's in there you sprinkle it with caster sugar so it adds a nice little crust on top. Once you've finished that you bake it in an oven and it's a fairly cool oven only 150 if you've got a fan forced oven for about an hour or until the test comes out clean. Now mine took probably about an hour and 10 minutes. After that you cool it in the tin before you turn it out. And this is what it turns out like. Thanks for watching Grubby Home Chef. Hope you've enjoyed it and don't forget to subscribe, like, comment and keep watching to see what Grumpy's cooking next time.